What's up guys? Today we are here with a new video and it is a kettlebell storage unit. As you can see, we just took the kettlebells out of the boxes like kids on Christmas and we are so happy. They're beautiful. We got them for a great deal and we know our clients will love them. But the issue is, is we're working with a limited amount of space. We're working out of a garage and we know that we have nowhere to store these. So I said, why not design a kettlebell storage unit that I know you guys would appreciate it. So I had all the materials on hand, so I got to it right away. So the first thing was to actually cut the base in which the kettlebells would be stored on. And I'm actually mocking everything up beforehand because I have a problem uh, actually designing equipment because sometimes when I mock it up, it's twisted or it doesn't work right. So I, I, I cut once, but I measure twice. So I, I'm right now I'm tacking it all up um, and my breaker was kept going out. So my welder kept turning off. I think the welder, cause I got a new welder. It just kept taking too much juice out of the house and it just kept flipping the breaker. But we had a good time designing it like always. I didn't paint this one or powder coat it because I knew I was gonna redesign this unit when we transition into a full facility. So I just said, why don't I just put some something together for now until we actually have the physical facility. So as you can see right now on screen, I, I'm walking around, the breaker went out again. I have to keep running into the house and flipping the switch. And it, it was just um, an inconvenience and a nuisance because I couldn't lay down a proper weld, but it all worked out in the end. As you can see, I'm kind of getting upset as well, but that's okay. We got it done on record time. So as you can tell, the left hand side is the shelf, the bottom portion of it. And on the right is the top portion of it in which the kettlebells will be actually be sitting on. And I want to show you the actual construction of it because I know you guys want to know. I, I know you guys want to know and appreciate each aspect of it. What you're looking at right now is the feet welding the stilts uh, onto the feet of the storage unit. I actually had the feet left over from some prowlers I was designing for some clients. So I had it in uh, stored away and I said, perfect. It's a perfect time to use it. And it worked out perfectly. It fit the tubular steel really well. And all the general construction of it all went well together. So what I'm doing is those feet I'm welding onto the shelves I just showed you in that previous shot. Okay, and what this is going to do, it, it allows it to raise it off the ground a little bit so it's easier to access when you are grabbing the kettlebells. We want two shelf levels, a higher portion and a lower portion. The lower portion is going to hold the heavier weights and the higher portion is going to hold the lighter weights. And if you guys don't know why, you don't want the heavy, heavier kettlebells falling off and dropping on your toe. It's easier to grab off the lower shelf. And right here, what you guys look at is the garage gym. We put it together after a long winter. We designed a lot of great equipment. So we're really proud of it and happy to show you guys. And we know our clients will love it. Now on to the main attraction of the whole video, the kettlebell storage unit. She looks great there. She really helped clean up the gym and brought it together. And the kettlebells look great there. And I honestly don't want to paint it or powder coat it. I think it looks great like that. It gives it that kingdom of iron type feel. The heavy weights on the bottom, the light weights on the top, but we want to give you guys a sneak peek of the next project. And this is going to be the next custom made equipment video. If you guys like our videos or like this video, please scroll down, hit that thumbs up button. It really shows us that we're doing a great job out here. Comment if you have any great videos idea for us. We're an entertainment channel. We I wouldn't just say we're specifically meant for fitness. We have a lot of talents on our team. And also guys, hit that subscribe. It really helps us get our name out there and shows us we're doing a great job. Remember guys, build your kingdom.